So let me be absolutely clear about what's just happened with Labour's first budget since 2010. The implications for British business are significant and you need to understand them now. So the headlines would tell you that corporation tax remains at 25%. True. But that's not the real story. The fundamental shift is in employers' national insurance contributions. They're lowering the threshold from 9,100 to 5,000 pounds. Those are the facts, but here's what matters. They're doubling the employment allowance to 10,500. And for small businesses, this creates a critical strategic opportunity. The numbers are clear. Proper planning could mean significant savings. On property investment, Yes, the stamp duty surcharge is increasing to 5%, but let's be perfectly clear, there are entirely legitimate ways to structure your property portfolio through limited companies and strategic timing of acquisitions. This isn't about avoidance, it's about intelligent business planning within the framework of the law. And the fuel duty cut extension? That's a significant operational consideration for businesses with a lot of transport costs. But you need to factor this into your broader financial strategy now, not later. So here's what you need to do. First, review your payroll structure immediately. Second, analyse your property holding arrangements. Third, calculate your precise NI liability under the new threshold. These aren't suggestions, they're imperatives. The window for implementing these changes effectively is closing. This isn't about clever accounting, it's about strategic business management. And I'm telling you, based on detailed analysis, there are clear opportunities here for businesses that act decisively. Please follow, comment and share. And if you want to get in touch with me, uh, please go to redboxfinancial.com, the chat box there, and that comes directly to me. That's all for now. Happy budgeting. Bye.